Colorado School of Mines, where uh, one of the things we're researching is alternative fuels, specifically fuels that can be made directly from solar energy. These are different types of the strains of green algae, and here uh, we can grow them uh, in great amounts. Right now these are test plates to uh, eventually be able to test with sensors that we make here at the School of Mines, which are able to uh, test the presence of hydrogen gas. Cell Center. This is at the uh, Colorado School of Mines, and uh, we're here uh, making proton exchange membranes and testing them in our fuel cell test systems, as you see here. All right, uh, the hydrogen that we use for our fuel cell is made from uh, natural gas, but in the future we'd like to uh, obtain our hydrogen from an environmentally friendly source, uh, water, and we could possibly use uh, solar cells or wind energy to produce electricity that can split the water to produce the hydrogen that we need. So here we have the oxy hydrogen generator. We're using electricity from the battery charger into the cell, out the hose, into the water bath. One really nice thing about this setup is that you can use solar power to generate oxyhydrogen, and this is a 35 watt panel. <laughs> 